ATV City. Salad Bar Central. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're back at it. What are we doing, Justin? I don't know. There's a lot of food in here. I just saw that. There's a party it's happening here on Christmas. Thursday. That's Christmas. my fishing trip food. Beer and crispers. And then there's a party on here Thursday. Here Thursday. So, I feel like I didn't yeah. know about this. You know, it's not really like a young person party. It's a bunch of old people. Hey, I can drink wine. <laughs> Uh, anyways, we got this potato gun out. People have been asking about this thing. They love seeing it. They love when I shoot it. You can shoot anything out of it. As long as it fits in the barrel, it will, it will go. So we have shot gravel, spears, ice, gas, water, flour, Justin's hopes and dreams. She gone. Yeah, she gone. <laughs> Uh, basically, yeah, so these are ice pellets. Basically, I just bought a pipe, cut it up, caps on the end. Um, a lot of people ask how you make these. Basically, you just need two PVC pipes, uh, the little Y adapter at the end, the little bike tube thing, pressure gauge, so you know how much pressure is in there. I put about 100 P PSI. This is just a piece of wood with tape around it. And yes, we chose pink because... Breast cancer awareness. Right? Yeah, so another piece of wood. Then just the U adapters here and a valve. And you put a piece of wood on top so you can open it real fast because the valve, you know, she likes to stick. We're not responsible for anything that is to occur if you mess it up. If you decide to mess it up. And yes, we have messed it up before. We made a big one. This guy at Home Depot said, Hey, you should make a bigger one. We're like, oh, great idea. And it did not work. And we were filling it up with this pump and the end blew off and almost went through the garage door. So that's what that dents from. But uh, yeah, what do you think? Somebody's gotta do it. All right, so we're thinking, and yes, it did hurt. We're gonna shoot some, we're gonna try and shoot one ice pellet over in the river. Then we're gonna do a fireball of death then we're gonna get the rest of the ice, go down the track, shoot one of the cars. Then we're gonna rip the car around. And yeah, that'll be the video, so. That'll be the day. That'll be the day. That'll be the evening. Uh, oh yeah, we need the gas too. The VP race. Oh no, I just, I was changing my oil, or my air filter the other day. It's like it's very greasy. And yeah, I might have gra grabbed the gas can and you will, yeah. Right? Okay, let's load this thing up, let's shoot it, and let's see what happens. And when you're shooting anything out of a potato gun, you always gotta put a rag in here. I usually like to get it wet first, just so you can seal it. And then I usually just push it in with a broomstick or something, and then that way, no air gets around it, and then you lose all your pressure, right? So, Justin's just getting the ice, I'll shove that in there, and then we'll fire it off. So these are our ice bullets. They don't like to stay together all in one piece. For some reason, they expand and crack, but you know, that's still a pretty good size. And then you just bring it over here. I already got this thing pumped up to about one five, or leaks out a little, it's around hundred. So you just slide it in. Somehow. It's like, so she's pretty airtight. So yeah. Should we fire it off? Do something. Well, I'm not really the best at aiming this thing, so I'm gonna try and see if it makes it down the river there. What are, what are your bets? You think, yeah? Uh, agree to disagree, it might not make it. <laughs> All right, you might have to zoom in on this one. You ready? Yeah. You see it? No idea where it is. Oh. Right in the middle of the river. <laughs> it went uh, just behind that tree to the right of the birdhouse. Okay, right back there. Jeez, that thing flew. I saw the rag went, nope, that's definitely not <laughs> no. it. For a chunk of ice that's not very aerodynamic, I'd say we did pretty good. Keep right. on. Let's do the flamethrower and then go we'll shoot some cars. Shoot some cars? Shoot I the like cars. that. I like that. <laughs> yeah, I won't 
point this at you. Uh, so that went well. We landed in the river from the house, which is fairly far. You know, I would say a couple hundred feet. a lot of feet. window here. Well, good thing the microphone's on the other side. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> that better? Um, so now we're going to try and skip some ice across water. Justin's idea. And then uh, we'll do the flamethrower and then down to the cars. So Feel free to join me. But how do we join? I don't know. For every like, it's one join. <laughs> how low should I go here? That is always the question. Well, I'm gonna go to this side of you. Like this? I'm gonna that work. Go. Hold your horses there for a second. I'm gonna try and balance on this rock here. Are you? Maybe you should stand more far. I should back. back. I should back up. Just getting too excited, you know. Okay, ready? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was kind of cool. I counted five skips. What'd you get? I just got a lot of mist in the face. <laughs> <laughs> How do we get a rake? <laughs> we'll get it when it goes down there. Well, that was pretty cool. So, yeah. Good idea on the ice skipping, Justin. Yeah. Well, it's natural home, right? <laughs> yeah. You come home. The river's going to be a little colder, but uh, fish will be happy. I think yeah. we scared the fish anyway. Yeah. All right. Let's, uh, let's go shoot the fireball again. The yellow bass. Maybe you should. Yeah. <laughs> Can you go get that, Justin? <laughs> that one's out. <laughs> All right. Attempt number three. We got some gas this time, and we're going to do a photo. Of the day. A photo of the day. Of the day. We win. <laughs> Can you carry this too? It's loaded. Kind of half loaded. It's got air and a rag in it. No gas yet. Air and a rag. Air rag. Don't point it at my face. Please. Thank you. Bye. So we made the executive decision to do it over the river. And Justin, I don't know what he's doing. I never know what he's doing up there. I don't even know what I'm doing. We got the GoPro. She's not fully out. Oh, I just felt a drop of rain. So we're gonna try and get the most epic of photos. And yeah, let's see how it goes, right Justin? You just never really know. You never really know how it's gonna go until it goes. Then we then we're done. Then we're done. Then we're gone. So let's Let's see how it goes, and then uh, we'll see how many people comment, Photoshopped! <laughs> At least three. <laughs> At least Every three. Time. It's gotta be Photoshopped. One time we did a potato gun photo down here. I'm sure you guys have all seen it with the big flame. But anyways, Justin was up on that hill shooting down, and the river looked like the clouds, so everyone was freaking out, saying it was all Photoshopped, and it's really just a reflection. And then Justin made them feel stupid. Not really. <laughs> I commented once and one kid called me a name and I just felt bad. <laughs> and you cried yourself to sleep after? <laughs> Alright, let's Never do know. this. Never know. That was well executed. It is a pleasure to watch him work. We got a lovely sky going on up here. Should be great for photos. Let's see what actually happens there. And just like that, we uh, look a river on fire, but it's all good. It's all good. It's just the Thames. I lit the water on fire. Bye, Cloud. All right, how cool was that? I mean, on a scale of Trump and America, it was full of the gallery. <laughs> Can we see the picture? And it literally just started to rain too, so. We did awesome. Ooh. And I lit the water on fire. And almost my arm. Probably why I have no hair on my hand. It's like we're shooting a musket. I mean, that's pretty cool. It didn't really help that the wind was at my face. It's true. <laughs> oh well. And now the potato gun rolled coal. <laughs> this thing rolls all the coal. We must have a 12 valve. <laughs>
Dip in the old horn. Oh yeah, those will work. Perfect. All right. We always start with me putting my boots on. <laughs> it always starts with, why is your boot way over there? I got excited. <laughs> <laughs> we just did the second shot and it turned out well. I did, I shot with the wind this time instead of into the wind. I really didn't think that first one over, you know, like most of my moves. So it turned out way better. Why? Now you can just Photoshop that, double the size, put some unicorns in it. All the unicorns. All the unicorns. Should we go cause some car trouble now? We should go make a claim. I we should fulfill that claim. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. We got a new accessory for the Platinum. Loaded potato gun. Oh yeah. We gonna shoot some things. Some things. Some things today. Not the dirt. Today. Maybe the Jetta. Today. So this is the last of our series of potato gun shots. This time we have ice in it and we're just gonna shoot through the back of the Aztec. I haven't taken it back to the scrapyard yet because I haven't got new cars. So there's about three blocks in here and about 100 PSI. So enjoy. Want this, in, want this in slow mo? No, no. No, no. No, no. You ready? No. Good? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's a strong back window. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I'd even crack it. <laughs> wow. Wow. I guess something's good about the Pontiac. Do they even make Aztecs anymore? I don't know. I don't know. That's an Aztec question. That is an Aztec. Get on the forums. I'm sure there's some uh, spare parts here for anyone doing a rebuild or a project vehicle. Your spare parts, bud. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you guys for watching. We're going to wrap this one up. And uh, yeah, fade to black. See you on the other side. Watch for zombies. Take care. Cut your hair. Goodbye.